everyone. Yeah, it's okay. Hi. <laughs> everyone, Hi. just three more people. <laughs> How are you doing tonight? Good. Everything good? I'm okay. Everything is awesome. Hey, what you have behind you on the background, Alvin? It's a picture, right? Yeah, it's uh, it's my. How do you say in Spanish? Confirmación, con my confirmation in mm -hmm. in uh, mass in mm -hmm. my in, in my school, Colegio Champañat. Ah, okay. <laughs> yes, I, I I did my 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 confirmation uh, in my thirty two years old. At the age of thirty two. Thirty two, thirty two. Yes, at the age of thirty two. Okay. There is, I don't know if it's in this group or the other one, but there is a teacher from that school, from Champagnac. I don't know in which group she is, but anyway. And what about you, Yesenia? How's everything? You're on mute. Yesenia, you are muted. <laughs> hey, I how are you doing? You. Fine. Well, good. Are you ready? Ready? Awesome. Okay. I see you, Ismenia, Melissa. Could you turn your camera on, please? I would appreciate that. Okay. Well, let's begin. Thank you, Melissa. All right. You're welcome. Let's begin. We finished this part last night. All right. We did all the way till section 1.4. Now we're gonna start section 1.5, okay? Can you read the instructions, please? Uh, Ismenia? Adieu. I read. Yes, go ahead. Okay. Uh, by the end of this class, participants uh, will learn adjectives that describe personal uh, Characteristics? Yes, we're going to be talking about characteristics using some adjectives, so that should be fine. Okay, let's pay attention to the pronunciation. Hold on, let me play that video for you. All right, and I'll mute everyone's microphone. Give me one second. There it is. All right, let's watch. Hi, Carla. Hi, everyone. And Alexander is trying to join. All right. Hi, everyone. By the end of this class, you'll learn adjectives that describe personal characteristics. Audio program in which you'll identify the adjectives that best describe each individual. So let's get started by learning the adjectives that you see before you. I'll be making this document available so you can have it for reference. Easygoing. An easygoing person is someone who doesn't worry much or get angry easily. Egotistical. An egotistical person is someone who has a very high opinion of himself or herself. Inflexible. An inflexible person is someone who doesn't change easily and is stubborn. Modest. A modest person is someone who doesn't brag about his or her accomplishments. Sociable. A sociable person is someone who enjoys being with other people. Stingy. A stingy person is someone who doesn't like sharing. Supportive. A supportive person is someone who is helpful and encouraging. Temperamental. A temperamental person is someone who has unpredictable or irregular moods. Unreliable. An unreliable person is someone who doesn't do what he or she promised. Now what we're going to do is we're going to listen to an audio program at this time. And as I mentioned, we need to be familiar with these adjectives in order for us to answer the questions 
from this audio program. What we're going to do in this audio program is we're going to listen to a description of Andrea, James, and Mr. Johnson. And then what I would like for you to do is to choose. Okay, this is not on the platform, so it's only here, right? These questions, look, which statement best describes Andrea, all right? Which statement best describes James? And which statement best describes Mr. Johnson? All right, try to answer those questions right now and write them down, please. The best statement that describes each individual. So let's listen to that audio program at this time. So, have you seen Andrea lately? Yeah, I see her once in a while. How's she doing? I've been meaning to call her. Well, to be honest, she's kind of been getting on my nerves lately. What do you mean? She's changed a lot since we've started college. She talks about herself all the time, and she always manages to mention how good she is at everything she does. Really? That would be annoying. It is. You know, she asked me to be roommates with her next semester, but I don't think I want to live with her. She used to be really generous, but now she's just the opposite. And it's not just with money, but her time as well. Well, college can be stressful. You two are good friends. Maybe you need to talk more. Are you going to James's party on Saturday? Of course. James always gives the best parties. And there are always lots of interesting new people to meet. It's true. I don't know where he manages to find them all. Well, you know what he's like. He makes friends very easily. He really likes talking to people. And he loves inviting people over. Uh-huh. He invited me for dinner last Saturday. What a feast. Yeah, he's a great cook, too. After dinner, I offered to help clean up. And he told me not to worry about it. He said he'd take care of it later. He was like, it's nothing, no big deal. Yep, that sounds like James. Have you met the new apartment manager? Mr. Johnson? Yeah, I met him last week. He's a little strange. Yeah, he is. I'm not sure I like him. He's hard to predict. Sometimes he's pretty cheerful and talkative. And the next day, he doesn't even say hello. I think he must have personal problems or something. I think you're right. And have you noticed that half the time when he says he's going to do something, he never actually does it? He told me three times he'd come to fix the light in my kitchen, and he still hasn't done it. Okay, let's see the answers. I think he must... How can we describe Andrea? Andrea. Andrea is someone who is still... egoistical and stingy. Egotistical, egotistical. and stingy. Yeah, egotistical. Stingy. 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 Yeah, it's egotistical and stingy. Very good. Number two. James is someone who is sociable. And is he's going. Say sociable. And is he going? Sociable and is he going? Is he going? Uh, is Guys, this is so shabble. All right, so shabble. So shabble. And this is a Z. Easy going. Easy going. Very good. Okay, and three. Temperamental. Temperamental. And unreliable. And unreliable. Unreliable. I think we have to check the pronunciation quickly. Okay, how do you pronounce this? Easy going. I, hold on. Is it going? Is it yeah, going? It, this is a Z, right? Easy. Easy, easy going. What's oh, the big? Um, okay. Uh, what about this? Egotistical. Egotistical. So it's like E, okay. This one? Egotistical. Mm -hmm. Flexible. Inflexible. Very good. This one? Modest. modest. It's like this. Mo and that D sounds like an R. Okay, so it's modest. 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 Okay. This one? Sociable. sociable. This is O and this is sh. Okay. Sociable. 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 That sounds better. Is there a good? This sounds like G. Like manager. Stingy. Same sound. Stingy. 
Stingy. Stingy. Stingy. Uh -huh. Okay. So do things you don't have to do here. You shouldn't do them here. It, it's not is, all right? Don't pronounce this E. It's s. s stingy. stingy. This is short. It's e, and this is e. Stingy. Okay, so you have two different sounds here. You have e and e. Okay, stingy. It's stingy. Yes, stingy. Exactly. Yes, stingy. Stingy. Uh, this is more like the Spanish e, and this is e, 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 e. Okay. Stingy. What about this? Stingy. Stingy. Supporty. Supporty. At Supporty. the end, this V Supportive. has to vibrate, right? V Supportive. 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 Yes, very good. This one? Tem temperamental. Tem temperamental. This T has to be more plush. Temperament. Tem temperamental. 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 Okay, and <laughs> reliable. No way. I'm reliable. I'm um, unreliable. Re la yeah. Like this reliable. Unreliable. Say it one more time. Unreliable. Unreliable. Yes. Reliable. No mistake this time. Very good. Read them with me one more time. Okay. Easy going. Easy going. Easy going. Egotistical. Easy going. Egotistical. Inflexible. 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 Flexible. Modest. Modest. Sociable. Modest. Sociable. 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 Yes, very good. Okay. Um, can you guys take a screenshot of this in case you have to use them? All right. I would like you to practice using some of them, but I'm going to send you some questions right now. We're going to talk about personality to practice your fluency. Okay. Um, pre advanced one. All right. Check the questions. Everybody's on WhatsApp, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah. So I will send you a lot of questions. You don't need to discuss them all, just as many as you can. All right, so we're talking about personality. If you can include these adjectives or any other adjectives to talk about personality, that's cool. Let's add them, right? So I sent you the questions. We're gonna discuss in groups. Do you have questions? Yeah. No? Yes, questions? Teacher, can you repeat it again? The the second one, please. Yeah. I can hear you very well. How do you pronounce? Egotistical. Egotistical. No, it's actually e. Egotistical. Egotistical. Yeah, because you say your ego. Egotistical. 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 Yes. Okay. Thank you. My pleasure. Okay. Let me see, I'm gonna make five, four rooms. Accept the invitation, let's discuss the questions. I'll be with you in a second. Let's practice. All right, accept it. Uh, what are some characteristics of your personality? Personality. Personality. What are some characteristics? What makes you happy? Who is going to be the first? Um, in my case, what makes me happy is uh, going to the beach. Yes, that's a great one. Excellent. And you, Carlos, what makes you happy? Mm, for me, uh, 
I, I, I love to see um, movies, uh, watch movies at home. And also I love to read, um, reading different books. <laughs> That's good. Carlos, somebody's knocking, right? I can hear some noise. No, um, in the next city are the parties. Um, ah, those are fireworks then. <laughs> <laughs> and they are happy and... <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna ask you a favor, sorry. Can you mute the microphone and when you speak, unmute it. Okay, but I would like everybody to answer the question. Okay, so Yesenia, what makes you happy? And Alexander? Okay. I, um, I like, um, I like read and I like, and I, I like, uh, and I, I like reading and I like uh, watching uh, movies. Mm -hmm. Uh, that makes you happy. Okay. Good, good, good. Alexander? When the person is, is uh, motiva motivation. Motivated. Motivated. Motivated, motivated yeah. And, uh, and, and happiness, I don't know. <laughs> motivated and happy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, what and, about and, you, Gio? Hi. Hi. What about you? Uh, I'm a music guy in person. And I'm a supportive. Um, I'm, you can um, say two things, Gio. You can say, I am a supportive person or I am supportive. I'm supportive. Okay. I'm supportive. And I think I'm. I'm like, uh, joyful. Mm. Yes, you I can like say to... that, joyful. Yeah. Joyful. Yeah. Um, I like to, to make jokes and mm -hmm. I have a, a good time with people. Okay. Yeah. I have a, I have a question for Beatrice. Mm -hmm. For Beatrice. Lisa. Perdón. perdón. Melissa, sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Where is he, Beatrice? Okay, all right. Oh, Melissa. Oh, uh, tell yeah, me. Melissa, um, uh, do you consider yourself selfish? Selfish. Why? Do you consider yourself? Selfish. Yourself selfish. Selfish is egoista. It's like a sí, uh -huh. um, yeah. narcissist, I don't know. <laughs> Do you consider narcissist yourself? is different, I think. Oh, okay. <laughs> and, and then it's I think I I think I am not. The, uh, um, soccer player. Yeah. Mm. And and I right now I have thirty uh, six years old. I am. And I play only for fun. Ah, okay. Okay. Yeah. And you also? Um, uh, the things makes me happy, for example, uh, I think uh, uh, share uh, time with my family, right? Um, uh, practice, uh, uh, play guitar, okay? So Sorry? if if you start the sentence with a verb, you have to use ing. Okay, so playing ah. guitar, going out with friends, being Thanks. in my house makes me happy or make me happy. So ing. Okay. Ah, okay. Ing. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Continue. Okay. I want to hear. Okay. Okay. Um. And uh, uh, um. So, oh, I don't know. Then maybe with um, another things may not be or um, let me see. Cooking, for example, is another thing that made me happy. Yeah, it's another thing. And what about you? It's mania. Tell us. Uh, I love to. 
I spend time with my sister, my mm -hmm. only sister, and also watch movies with her. So and and also cooking, <laughs> cooking. Ah, yes. And, yes, and, and I spend eating. Time <laughs> and I spend time with my 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 boyfriend and my my friends, but I love watch movies and just that. Oh. Yes. Really? Well, watch. Sorry. I didn't he hear you. Ah, oh, oh, really? Uh, what kind of uh, movie do you? The, the word. <laughs> uh, teacher, uh, how yes? do you say cartillar? Uh, hammer. Hammer. Yes. Okay. It's also the verb and the noun. Okay, that noise uh, makes me feel angry because I have to to speak louder. And yes. I, I say to my, to my students, uh, can you hear that? And they say, no, no, really not, teacher. But I am so... <laughs> I, I don't know, that uh, makes me feel, um, I don't know, frustration. Frustrated. 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 Thank you. So, next question. Hmm. Okay, Veronica. Are you happy with your personality? Yes, I am happy, but I'm trying to change uh, something. Uh, things on my personality. For example, I try to study the emotional intelligence because it's for work is very important. You can uh, change. Uh, for example, if you got angry easily. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And Julia, um, sorry, Veronica. What are you trying to improve? What area specifically? Um, specifically, maybe when you talk about another person, uh, I have a problem with uh, my voice is a, uh, how do you say grave? It is, is deep, you can say. Yes, and then try to dance a lot uh, with my voice. Like, <laughs> you try, for example, when I try not to what? To not uh, talking loud. I try not to talk loud. Yeah, because with an angry, I, I try yeah. to do, do that, <laughs> to do that. Yeah. Okay. Try to modulate your voice. Yeah, this is specific. <laughs> <laughs> and you, yeah. Beatriz, are you happy with your personality? Yes, uh, I forgot today I had uh, enough uh, passion, but sometimes I lost, I, I lost the the control, and mm -hmm. I try to. You lose your temper all the time. I, try, I yes, yes. I try to 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 be a, a, a better person, and I try to to maintain or maintain maintain the, maintain. the control about that. Uh, keep control, you can say, or maintain. Keep. Maintain. Yes. Okay. And what about you, Alvin? Well, <laughs> I think I, I'm, I'm happy with my my personality. Um, the people say that. I don't, know, I don't want to say that about myself, but hey, I want to hear Alvin. Sorry? Hey, I want to hear. I don't know. I say. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I always try to be serious. But always uh, say something that the people finish uh, laughing about what I said. I don't know why, but. Oh, but you're uh, funny. <laughs> I, don't <know. laughs> I don't know why. I mean, you don't yeah, say finish laughing. They end up laughing. Yeah. End up laughing. Okay. Yes. For example, I can say, you know, one day I was going to San Miguel and I ended up in Cuscatlan, for example, the wrong side, right? So you can say end up <laughs> is a verb. We're going to go San Miguel, in fact. Sorry? In fact, I am from San Miguel. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> that was an example, but OK. It was suitable. All right, let's go back.
let's wait for everyone. <laughs> Some of you have happy faces. Are you enjoying the conversation? Yes. Yes, yes. it's fine. <laughs> yes, yes, of course. Marvin is. Okay, and yes. what we're gonna do right now, we're gonna continue speaking. I sent you another image. Let me see what expressions. Uh -huh. So I sent you the second image. What I want you to do now, you're gonna talk to different people, okay? What I would like you to do is start with the last question and up, okay? Think about the last okay. question first with different people, all right? We're gonna talk for 10 more minutes and then we'll continue working on the platform. All right, ready? That's the alarm. Recreate, okay. Accept the invitation, please. Start with the last question, the very last one. Okay. No. Uh, it's many a high man. <laughs> we don't see you. Sorry, I am I am mute. Sorry. <laughs> you were on mute. The 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 me mutié. In Spanish, it's me mutié. Uh, Teacher, I didn't get the the last question in the WhatsApp. You haven't received them. Yeah. What is what is one thing that many people don't know about you? Okay, this, hold this on. Question. Open open the second image. Okay, and you're oh, gonna oh, start oh. discussing the last question. The last question is. Do you think this one here? Do you think birth order makes a difference in your oh, personality? Okay. For example, are you the first child? I get it. The youngest child? I get it. Okay. Do right. you think birth? Do you think birth? Feel comfortable. I don't feel. I don't feel comfortable. Uh -huh. No comfortable. Comfort. Ah, <laughs> really? Yes. Uh, Repeat the game, please. Hold on, let me break it yes. in three. Comf okay. -er -ball. Comfortable. Comfortable. Yes. Com 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 there. Com comfortable. Com no, com comfortable. 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 <laughs> let me write it here. On the chat. Yes. Ah, okay. Thank you. Something like that. Ah, comfortable. 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 Ah, okay. Comfortable. Okay. Ah, comfortable. Comfortable. Okay. Okay, or you have another option. You can also say comfortable. What what is the normal one? Like a synonym? Synonym? Right? A synonym of what? Comfortable? Syn yeah. A synonym of comfortable is familiar. Yes. Ah. Ah, it's more easy to have familiar. No, but you need comfortable. Marvin, you can say it. Come on. You can do this. You got it. Ah. <laughs> Comfort. <laughs> Comfort. The bowl. Comfort. 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 Comfortable. Yes. Ah, yes, Carla. But the Good. stress, the stress is on the first syllable. Comfort, comfortable. Comfortable. Yes, exactly. That's the one. Marvin, try it. Comfortable. Comfortable. Yes, that Let also works. Let me see works. the chat. That com comfortable. Terrible. Comfortable Com or comfortable. Com comfortable. Yes, good, good. Yes, in the chat. Yes, in the chat. Oh, okay, I practice a lot. Okay. <laughs> that sounded great, actually. Okay. 
Okay, the last question is, uh, do you think bird other makes a other? difference? Other, other. Ah, sorry, I'm dyslexic. Do you think bird order makes a difference in your personality? Yes. Uh, Do you know the meaning of birth order? Yes, like if you are the first child or the second. Ding, ding. That's what it is. Nacer? Nacer? Uh, the birth order is okay. Yes, how many siblings do you have? How Two. many siblings do you have? Siblings, yeah. Two. Sorry, how many siblings do you have? I, I can hear you. How siblings. Many? siblings is brothers and sisters. Ah, how many siblings yeah. do you have? Um, two, three, you have two, and you, Marvin? Four, five. <laughs> yes, and yeah, it's counting them. Oh my gosh! <laughs> yes, it's a lot. It's a large yeah. family, right? It's a big family. Count, yeah. No, I counted the the the, the brother and sister uh, for my my. My father, from my father's father. side, they are your half siblings, half siblings. Okay, Yesenia, this is the point. Imagine you have one brother and one sister. You have <laughs> the oldest one, the middle one, and the youngest one, the baby, okay? So that's the birth order. Mm. Mm -hmm. I think okay. there is a difference about Can you explain that question? Because I don't understand very well. Tell one thing, one that many people don't know about you. Ah, okay. I understand. In my case, uh, I usually or sometimes I'm a little shy. But it explains, <laughs> it, it depends uh, the people. On the people. Uh, yes, it depends the people. It depends on the people. It depends on the people. Very good. Okay. Gio? Um, I, I you can say I like rock. Because <laughs> we all I, know I, that. I remember. I we all know obvious. that. <laughs> say the truth, Gio. A story. I like bachata. When, I, when I was when I was twenty, I'm sorry. many years ago, <laughs> um, my the parents from my ex 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 ex, ex girlfriend, mm -hmm. uh, everybody said that I, I look so serious and angry and bad and, <laughs> and all all bad things and Not evil. Bad, yeah, and evil. And when, when when they have the opportunity to to know me, they they change their mind because they they notice that that I I'm a I'm a shy person. I'm. Yeah. Uh, in my in my life to from my 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 first my first years to. High school, I think. Nobody knows my name. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh in, my in, god. In my case, a lot of people don't know my first name because I present uh, to the old people with my second name. Jonathan, my first name. You yep. introduce yourself to other people. Uh, yeah, I introduce myself with other people with my second name. I with never use name. my... The middle name, yeah. Okay, my, the middle name. What is your middle name? Yeah, uh -huh, yeah tell us. <laughs> my, my first name is, is Eliezer. Ah. I always use Jonathan. Okay. Yeah. Nice. But Eliezer, it's nice. 
Eliezer. It's not common. It's not common. But I have this problem. The people don't uh, pronounce, uh, <laughs> pronounce the so name uh, correctly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Always say, say me, Eliazar, Eliezer. <laughs> Eliezer. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I don't know what are you talking about because my name is Carlos. Everybody, <laughs> everybody <laughs> know how to pronounce Carlos. <laughs> uh, in my case, spell. hey, Melvin, Marvin, <laughs> Selvin. Ah, yeah, Alvin. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, uh, but uh, what is your secret, Charlie? Uh, what? Uh, what about you? The people doesn't know. Yeah, it's normal. Here in my in my neighborhood, people mm -hmm. don't know what is my um, career. For example, they don't know. Maybe I think they uh, they don't know. Include that I was studying at university, so I'm professional, but ah. they don't know. Anybody know? Here my here my my, what is your my neighborhood. What is your career? I I am um, I'm psychologist and I have a master degree in, in human rights and peace education. Where did you study your master's degree, Carlos? Uh, I studied my master's degree at University of El Salvador, the bold career. Yeah. Mm, your major and your master's. My master, yeah. <laughs> yeah, let me send you something, guys. Okay, major is carrera, but it's related to education, okay? And career is related to work. A major is for major? For education. So you say your uh, major is, my major uh, is English, okay? And your major is psychology. Ah, uh, okay. My mm. major. Your major. career is when you start working. My career is now. teacher. Okay. Uh -huh. I have a okay. career as a teacher, in you my, can say. My major is... What did you study, Alvin? I have a... a, a the, I don't know, it's a... How do you say professoral? Um, that's like an associate's degree. Okay, I have a, a professoral... A, a no, an associate's. Licenciatura and a, a master. Let me send in, it to you. In investigation, research, investigation, research. associate degree. Associate degree is usually two or three years. Okay. Associate oh, degree. Associate yeah. You don't say degree. technical, all right, or professional. You Interbert. say associates. Associate. Associate. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Yep. Very interesting. No, Carlos, you would say um, people don't even know that I went to the university. Mm, even, yeah. even, yeah, yeah. Era, people even. don't even know. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm, exactly. But All right, let's go know. back. Very interesting. This was fun. Thank you. <laughs> uh, All right, let's go back. Hi, Ismenia. Hi, everyone. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> Oh, that was so much fun. I wanted to talk with you, <laughs> but I couldn't. <laughs> okay. Um, so, one of um, you, just one person, share a secret with us. Something nobody knows about you, or the majority of people don't. Marvin. Marvin, go ahead. Tell us. Okay, Jonathan. <laughs> Where is Marvin? Yes. Jonathan? What's, what's your secret, Marvin? <laughs> <laughs> my secret? Mm. About what? My powers? You have powers? <laughs> uh, uh, a superhero, right? Super uh, yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay, so let's do something quickly. Tell me one positive adjective about you and one negative adjective. Everybody. Quickly, okay, just one positive and one negative, okay? Let's begin. Anybody can start? Sociable. Me. Um, Sociable and? Think about them. Really? 
Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Have the answer ready, guys. <laughs> wait, Carla. So it's many. Uh, I'm a, a positive, I'm a loyal person, and the negative, I'm a shy or unsocial person. No, I didn't understand that. But anyway, just tell me two adjectives, for example, intelligent and unpunctual. Just the two adjectives. Uh, okay. okay. Again, it's many. Okay. <laughs> I'm an intelligent person, of course. And the the negative object, I'm a angry person. Okay, intelligent and angry. Continue, anybody. I'm a sociable person and a impatient or sociable sometimes inflexible person. And impatient. Just the two adjectives. Thank you. Yeah. Good. 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 Come on, guys. I'm okay. Everybody's like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm no. looking for answers. Confident. I'm sociable, uh, the, the positive and the negative, I'm bossy. Bossy, okay. Mm -hmm. um, I am person uh, positive and lazy. And lazy. <laughs> <laughs> no, probably am, optimistic. I, I, and lazy. Okay. I am a healthy person and I am sarcastic person. Ah, okay. <laughs> Interesting. I'm sociable and the bad one, I don't pay attention to details. <laughs> ah, okay. Hmm. Everybody Social participate? Uh-huh. And work and workaholic. And workaholic, good. Carlos? In my case, I am very uh, positive. Positive uh, oh, or, or optimistic? Oh, yeah. yeah, optimistic. Mm -hmm. and, but the bad thing is that I am obsessive. 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 Wow. Yeah. I like the adjectives <laughs> we're coming up with. I like these adjectives. Very advanced. <laughs> okay, one more person. No? Gio. Yeah, uh, I'm uh, friendly and confident, and I'm undecided. Undecided? Yeah. Huh, okay. <laughs> Great. All right, thank you. Are you sure, Gio? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I got it. Did you say undecisive? That's the word, undecisive. Okay, we're gonna see one more thing before we finish. Can you read the objective, please, Carlos? Carlos or Carla? Carlos. Hello? You're Sorry, good, teacher. The read the okay. objective, please. Ah, okay. Uh, listen, uh, by the end of uh, the, the, oh, the objective. By the end, uh-huh. Okay. By the end of this class, participants will learn how to express likes and dislikes using clauses with it plus adverbial clauses with when. Yeah, this is clauses. Clauses. Like, like Santa Claus? Clauses. 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 All right, very good. Let's watch and take notes, please. All right, let's watch. Have the notebooks ready to take notes, okay? Hello, everyone. In this class, you'll learn how to express likes and dislikes. And you'll also learn how to express neutral things. So let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. So let's say, for example, you want to express things that you like. Um, I'm going to use an analogy of a birthday, right? So a uh, quick example, I like it when my friends give me gifts for my birthday. I don't like it when my friends forget about my birthday. 
there I just express the likes and dislikes and I also want to be neutral about certain things so in order to do that I'm gonna use expressions such as I don't mind it when my friends arrive late to a party so let's do the following first the first thing that we should learn or that we should become familiar with is some uh, vocabulary okay uh, and so let me do just that let me just present this quick vocabulary if you notice I've highlighted in yellow the positive so for things that you like, you'll use expressions such as, I like it, I love it. When you're neutral about something, you'll use expressions such as, I don't mind it. Mind and it. when you want to express things that you don't like, then in that case, you'll use expressions such as, I don't like, I don't like it, I can't stand it, I hate it. So let me just quickly present the structure and how to formulate this kind of complex sentences. So when we say clauses with it and then we say clauses with when, well really what we're saying is that we want to express things that we like, that we don't like, or that we're neutral about at any given situation. So let me just present the structure here. What we want to do is we want to use clauses with it and then adverbial clauses with when. Uh, and we do this in order to express the things that we like, the things that we don't like, or the things that we might be neutral about. So, as I mentioned at the beginning, we ha I had a, a couple of examples for you. I'll just continue on with making more examples. So, so what kind of things do you like? Well, um, in order to formulate this sentence, to express that idea, we're going to have a subject. In this case, I'm just going to say I. The subject could be any other subject, by the way. Um, I use a verb such as like, so I say I like it, and that's my clause with it. And then uh, the next part, it continues with when, this is the situation, um, when. All right, so let me just make that quick sentence there. So I like it when someone gives me a compliment. This is something that I like. As you can see, we have the first part of the sentence is the subject plus the verb and it. I like it. And then the second part of that sentence is, when someone gives me a compliment. If we quickly look at our vocabulary here, I could say, this could be, now, the, the idea about this is that this could be something that is true for you, this could be something that is not true for you. So we want to express the things that you like, the things that you don't like, the things that you might be neutral about. So I could use this vocabulary here, so I could easily say, I like it, such as the example here. I like it when someone gives me a compliment. Um, or I could say, I love it. So I'll, I could change the verb. I could change something else there. I could say, I love it. Guys, please take notes because I would like you to use the expressions in the exercise. Okay, so write down, I love it when, I hate it when, I like it when, etc. Take notes, please, please, please. When someone gives me a compliment. Um, at the same time, I could also be neutral about it. I could say, I don't mind it. Right? Okay. I don't mind it when someone gives me a compliment. Uh, and then again, you might be shy and you probably don't like it, right? So you might uh, have a negative point of view about that situation. And you might say, I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it when someone gives me a compliment. And that's how you formulate this kind of uh, sentences. Um, again, you could be neutral about the whole situation. You could uh, you could um, uh, be positive about it. So you could like it or you could love it. Um, and um, at the same time, something could make you upset, right? Um, the examples that I gave earlier where I... So let me follow the structure here, right? So I'm going to say I like it when friends give me gifts for my birthday. Okay, so this is something that I like. So I like it when friends give me gifts for my birthday. I don't like it when friends forget about my birthday. Um, it doesn't bother me when friends arrive late to a party. 
Now what I would like for you to do is to think about all the things that you like and all the things that you don't like and all the things that you're neutral about. Did you write down the did you write down the expressions? Yes, teacher. Okay, I sent you some images, right? Yes. And did you see them? So what are the expressions? Help me out. What are they? I like I love it. it. I like I, it. I don't like I love it. it. When but don't forget when. Okay. I, I, don't, I don't mind. I hate I don't like it when I hate. I hate. I hate it when you have to use it and when. Don't forget it yeah, yeah, and I when. Hate it. I hate it when something. What else? I. I don't mind. I don't my... mind it. I don't mind it. I don't mind. I don't mind it when, when people. And I like it when. Okay, take a screen. Carla, can you do this, please? Could you take a screenshot and send it to a group? All right. Sure. Right. Thank you. So look at the situations, okay? And yeah, I will send you more situations tomorrow, but let's practice for five minutes. So look at the situations and I want you to express how you feel about these. For example, 30% of people who play obnoxiously loud music in their car, you can say, I don't mind it when people play loud music or you can say, I hate it. When, when people, for example, right? I hate it when people chew with their mouth open, like, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> or you can say, I love no, it I when people, <laughs> I love it when people yeah. chew with their mouth open. So how do you <laughs> feel about the situation? Is that clear? Yeah. No, yeah, yes, it's clear. No, yes. <laughs> All right. Um, on, hold on, let me make smaller groups. There. All right. Discuss some examples. Here we go. What is that noise? <laughs> I love that. I love that noise. <laughs> <laughs> I love it when people I love it. <laughs> make I love noise. It. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I love it when. But look at the images. It's many. Ah, yeah. Uh, the images. I, I hate uh, when people yeah. who al are always late. I hate it when people are always late. Try to combine the images with vocabulary, okay? okay. I hate it when people are always late. And you, Gio, and you, Ismania, how do you feel, how do you feel about people being late? Because it makes you waste your time. Let me see, I don't like it when people are like late. Uh -huh. I don't hate it, but I don't like it. Don't and like you, it. Veronica? I, I really hate it, <laughs> hate but it. I don't like it. Yeah, I yeah. don't like it when the people leave us always, always late. Okay, if there is no toilet paper in a public, in a public restroom, how do you feel? You like it? You hate it? <laughs> you don't mind it? I'm worried. I'm worried. It's a bit. Really, probably. <laughs> and you, yeah. and you, Carlos. Um, for example, uh, I love. Well, um, but the I don't mind it, guys. I don't mind. Are you discussing the examples? I don't know if you can see well. Yeah. Uh, these, for example, hold on. Okay, let me see. Okay. The, when when people. When people don't wash their hands, how do you feel? 
I love yeah. it when people don't wash their hands. I hate it when people don't wash their hands. So discuss the situation yeah. in the images. Mm -hmm. Well, Jonathan told about people. Uh, Sorry, guys. Uh, are you discussing the, the images, the situations here? For example, when people put uh, their bags on the seat, you know the situation, right? Yeah. You, you go in the bus, well, you go on the bus and there's nobody except bags. How do you feel? You hate it? You love it? You like it? So discuss with the images. Wow. Okay. Mm. Many? Are you discussing? I... Yes. yes, some of them. And some new. Okay. <laughs> Uh, so people walk really slowly. Yeah, I don't <laughs> like. I don't like it because I usually walk fast, and I said that I don't like when people drive. I don't like it when people drive when people drive slowly no. too. Yes. Okay. So mm -hmm. say I, I don't like it when. Try to use it and when. That is the purpose. Okay. Yeah. I don't like it when people are always late mm -hmm. because I usually I talk very mm -hmm. loud. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that is so familiar because you know I I have family from from uh, La Union, San Miguel, and and and, and they are used. I'm on mute. I know. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt the conversation. I know. Okay, tomorrow we will continue practicing this topic to begin the class and then study some more. But I think it's easy, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 Yeah. Okay. Well, it was very easy. Sorry. It was very fun. easy. Yeah. It was very yes. fun being with you tonight. Honestly. Thank <laughs> you. Yeah. Okay, and I hope to see everybody. If you cannot be in class, please send me a message. All right. With a um, okay. with a valid Fisher, excuse. Do you have a Do you have a WhatsApp group? Because I don't be. <sighs> You need aren't in the WhatsApp group? Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's a secret. <laughs> secret. <laughs> Seriously? Okay. Carlos. We have to know oh it very well gosh. after. <laughs> <laughs> no, yes, we have a WhatsApp group, Carlos. Does anybody have the link right now? Do you have the link handy? Yeah. Uh, Alvin is an administrator, right? Alvin, are you an administrator? No, no, no. Me? Do you have the link, guys? Uh, yeah. Yeah, no. Maybe. Okay. It's a joke, Alvin. Charlie, give me mail. Charlie, give me your your uh, your number, cell phone, please. Cell phone number. Cell phone number. Yeah. To send you the link. Uh -huh. Okay. Here's the link. Ah, I typed the Carlos, link. do it quickly, please. I have another class. I have to go. <laughs> quickly, quickly. You have it. Okay. No, Carlos. Uh, copy the link. Okay, okay, okay. Carlos, copy the link. All right. In the yeah, chat, guys. in the chat. Okay, perfect. Bye. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Have a good night. Bye. Bye, good Thank night. Thank you. Bye.